Hello everyone, and welcome to this new tutorial for Maverick Render. Today we will see how to import 3D models into Maverick. Importing an FBX file in Maverick Studio is really easy. It can be done from the start screen by using the Import and Merge button. By clicking the Import button that resembles a puzzle piece from the main toolbar, or by going to the File menu and selecting the Import or Merge entry. It is also possible to simply drag and drop a file from the Windows Explorer directly onto Maverick Studio. In the very first part of the dialog, you can decide whether you want to import as a new scene, or merge into the current one. You can also pick an ambience which will be used for lighting and shadows. Select one of the presets, and click Next. If required, you can change the model orientation using the flip vertical axis toggle. In this case the orientation was detected properly. The FBX format carries scale and unit information. The importer should read the file with the proper scale automatically. As a physically based render engine, Maverick works best with proper scale if you want predictable camera effects such as depth of field or proper lighting intensities. To this end, Always take a look at the information provided in the bounding box area just to make sure everything is to scale, which is the case here. In case a model would not import with proper dimensions, you can use your own custom unit and multiplier. Click Next to continue with the import process. This page shows special options that will be covered later in this video. Most FBX models, like this one, will import just fine with the default settings. So, click on the Proceed button. And there you go. The model is now rendering, with proper scale and orientation. Now let's take a look at a model that comes with all its parts attached in a single object. Once again select an ambience and click next. The dimensions are properly detected here as well as it is normally the case with FBX files. We will first import the model as it is to understand what the problem is. Turn off the apply unique random colors options. The model has imported properly, but it is one single object making it difficult to access at different parts. This can be fixed by importing again and using the special detaching options. The importer recalls your previous choices, so simply click Next. Here select the Detach by Part and Material option. This will create as many objects as there are materials but also attempt to detach parts that are isolated into separate objects. The grouping options tell the importer what to do with objects that were detached into multiple parts. You can decide to not group anything, or group the detached parts by the original objects the parts belong to, or by objects using the same material. In our case, grouping by same material will be ideal. You can recalculate normals in case the model smoothing was wrong after importing, which is not the case here. Click Proceed. The model has now imported, and you can see groups have been created from the detaching process, and everything is properly ordered. Every piece of isolated geometry is now detached giving a much easier access to submaterials. Thank you for watching this video. Have fun rendering with Maverick.